Tonight, the jury is seated in Hunter Biden's federal criminal trial. The president's son is facing felony charges tied to gun possession while using narcotics. Hunter Biden has pleaded not guilty to the charges. NBC's Bree Jackson is in Washington with the details. For the first time in U.S. history, the child of a sitting U.S. president is heading to trial. Hunter Biden is accused of making false statements when purchasing a gun by checking a box that claimed he was not an active drug user. It's a federal offense punishable by up to 10 years in prison for somebody to lie on a false form. The prosecution could call a range of witnesses, including Hunter's ex-wife and the widow of his brother, Beau, whom Hunter had a relationship with. The president's sole surviving son has pleaded not guilty. He's been open about his struggles with substance abuse and claims he was not using drugs at the time. His family stands firmly behind him. First Lady Jill Biden spending parts of her birthday inside the courtroom. You know, I'm, I love my son and it's had, it's hurt my grandchildren. Mm -hmm. And that's what I'm so concerned about, that it's affecting their lives as well. President Biden releasing this statement, saying, as the president, I don't and won't comment on pending federal cases. But as a dad, I have boundless love for my son, confidence in him, and respect for his strength. The president juggling family challenges and a heated political battle. Hunter is not running for president of the United States. Joe Biden is. And, and, and Donald Trump is. And I think that when you measure their character, wisdom, and judgment, you understand very clearly that Donald Trump is a danger to our democracy. Hunter's legal fight comes on the heels of former President Trump's conviction on 34 felony counts related to his New York hush money case. Criminal courts taking center stage in the 2024 presidential race. And Hunter Biden faces a second trial in September on federal tax charges. Last year, the White House said that President Biden will not pardon Hunter if he is convicted. In Washington, Bree Jackson, NBC News.